Welcome back. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to set up headphones on a Windows 11 PC or laptop. If your headphones come with a microphone or you are wanting to set up a headset, then click the card on screen now to watch my separate video showing you how to set up a microphone. You can watch that video after this one. You should be able to follow this video to set up any pair of headphones, whether they are connected via USB, a 3.5mm connector or another type of connection. The video should also help fix minor issues with your headphones, for example if they are not selected. Check my channel if you have any other problems or if it isn't working, as I'll have videos that help fix headphones that aren't working in Windows. Remember to leave a like and feel free to subscribe if the video helps. Let's get into the method. To set up headphones in Windows 11, the first thing we need to do is connect them. It is important that you choose the correct port on your PC to plug them into. Make sure it is the headphone port and not the microphone port and that the ports are compatible, such as with USB 2 and 3, although this shouldn't be a problem. Now that we have them connected, we have to ensure that they are selected and set up in Windows 11. We'll begin by making sure they are selected as the default sound output device. To do this, go to the main settings page. You can get there a number of ways, but we'll be searching for it in the search bar. In the settings, go to the system settings from the options on the left, although you should be already in there by default. In the system settings, click on the option called sound. Within the sound settings, find the section called output. It should be right at the top. Under here, it should say something like choose where to play sound. Below this, you should see the list of headphones or sound output devices connected to your PC. If you have multiple, select the one you want to use by checking the box to the left of its name. If you don't see your device here, scroll down and click on all sound devices. Now find your device from the output section, click on it and then choose allow on the next page. It should now appear back in the input section of the main sound settings page. From here, you can also quickly adjust the volume of the headphones with the slider. Click once on your headphones to customize some of the settings. First, you might be able to rename your headphones to something that helps you differentiate them with the others. Click rename under its current name to do this. Also within here, you can change some more settings, such as the quality format, the main volume, and the volume for the left and right channel separately. There might also be other settings to customize in here, like the option to turn on enhanced audio or spatial sound. You can search for the latest drivers at the top of the page, which is quite helpful too. Those are most of the ways to set up headphones. If for some reason something didn't quite work out, we can use the more traditional way to set up your headphones. This might have extra features as well, such as a bass boost, but most of the options will be the same as in the main settings page, so you don't necessarily need to follow this. To do this, first go to the control panel. You can get there by searching for it in the search bar. In the control panel, click on hardware and sound. Now click on sound and it should open a separate window. In the new window, first go to the playback tab. You should see all of the headphones, speakers and other output devices in here. If you don't see it, right click on an option and choose show disabled and show disconnected devices. To enable your headphones in here, right click on them and then click on enable. You can set it as the default sound output device in here too with the button. To customize the headphones settings from here, Double click on your headphones or right click on it and then go to properties. In the properties window, you can try and update any drivers by going to properties again, this time for the controller, then to the driver tab and then click on update drivers if you can. Back in the main properties window, each tab will have a few options to choose. The levels tab allows you to change the volume and the enhancements tab, which may or may not be there depending on your headphones, could include things like the bass boost. There will be other tabs that will have more ways to customize the sound, but these will differ with each pair of headphones. You can close this window once you are happy with the settings. And so that is how to set up headphones on a Windows 11 PC or laptop. Click the card on screen now to watch a video of mine showing you 10 easy ways you can speed up your Windows PC. Those methods should work on nearly all versions of Windows. Help support the channel by visiting the store. The link is in the description and at the end of the video. If you have any questions, then let me know in the comments below. And if you did find today's video helpful, remember to leave a like and feel free to subscribe for more tips in the future. 
be sure to stick around to see some of my other videos that you might be interested in. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in another video.